In last section, I explained you the syntax for SAS macro. Now in different workout, I am going to put together some of those syntax to explain you that how you put together these syntax to achieve a particular task. During this workout also you learn some syntax. So the first workout is where we want to run different procedure for different type of variable. If any variable is having number of distinct category less than a particular threshold say 50, then one has to run frequency distribution otherwise you are not supposed to run and that should happen irrespective of type of variable. So it is numeric or categorical, it doesn't matter. If the number of distinct category is less than 50, then run the frequency distribution. Secondly, you have to include missing as a category variable. You have to run univariate with plot for all numeric variables. What you need to understand, just for this portion, you don't need a macro. Probably, you could have used just proc univariate and use underscore numeric underscore and that would have run for all the numeric variable. But here the task is that you have to put frequency distribution and univariate output side by side. And that's where, you know, for one variable you need to run univariate and frequency distribution almost together or, you know, after just one syntax so that their output is side by side or at one place. And that's the reason you are not able to achieve that just by underscore numeric underscore. Also, you need to put descriptive title for each of the output. So these are the objective of the wor out workout that you want to achieve. So what are you going to learn through this workout? You will learn how to create a tool. What you need to understand, you don't know the name of the data set right now and you don't know how many variables are going to be in that data set. So you are going to learn how to create a generic tool which can run on various kind of data set. You will learn how to programmatically detect number of variables in a data set and create a loop so that it can run for all variables of the data set. Then detect number of distinct category through program and then run frequency distribution if the number of distinct category is less than a particular threshold. So you are going to learn how to pass a parameter and how to run frequency distribution for only those criteria which are only those conditions which are meeting above criteria. Then you will also learn univariate for the numeric variable and you will also learn how to put descriptive titles. What you need to understand, you have already seen some example of how to call macro, use macro, how to use macro variable, how to see macro variables and logic are getting decoded properly using some options and how to convert a SAS macro before comparing and you will see the usage of that once again here. So now let me go ahead and start to show you that how the macro is running.